I will share a funny story. Sure. Yeah. Um, he, I, I was a couple of days that I had been in the house, and then Fly wanted to <laughs> to see if my <laughs> my fucking dick was bigger than his. What so he told fuck? the girl he was what a dating. <laughs> bro, he he told the girl he was dating to take me to this room and see, and I'm just geeked off the yerky so i'm just like what is really going on right now like what's this guy on what's his mentality on i'm like okay fuck it bro you're telling me to do that so i'll do it because i mean show your dick to a girl it's not no bro it's not that big a deal it's not that big a deal on your part it's fucking weird on his part that he's thinking to, about this he wanted to know if my dick was bigger than his bro right. that's weird seems kind of insecure and then later on he found out that it was somehow he was like vium showed me a sex tape it was like I'm just like, why are you so stuck on that? You know, it's just little shit like that. Bro. And he was just bummed that he didn't have the biggest dick in the I house. Don't, <laughs> I don't know what could be going through bro mind, bro. But that's just like a story. Like, I'm telling you, that's a real story. Like, bae, go see. But we, and let me tell you this. I didn't show. She didn't try to get me hard or nothing like that. So you showed her the We softy. walked out and I was just like, no, bro, nothing. I didn't even show her my, oh. I didn't show her. We walk out and we're just kind of like, why would this guy make us do this? Like, right. go do that. Like, you know what I'm saying? If he wasn't such a little twerp. So I was like, bro, I'll just show you some sex tape shit. Like, yeah. Hey. Right. If he was like a 40-year-old man doing that, they would be talking about him like he was the biggest fucking weirdo in the history <laughs> of the world. He only can kind of get away with it because he's like young and handicapped. Yeah, bro. Wow, that's fucking crazy. Yeah, because, uh, oh, so was, was there a lot of drugs being done in the house? You said you were off a yerk. Uh, are, they, are, are they on that type of time as well? Yerkies, man, yerks. The bro. yerks are going around. Bro, in the I want to tell world. you this, bro. And let's let, we got to clarify something. The palm tree, they think it's a, it has to do with them. Their their logo brand is not. The palm tree is my stuff. How long have you had that? It's Tropical Mafia. Um, you had it before you started kicking it with them? Nah, I got it with them. Oh. Uh. Yeah, but people be trolling me like, oh, you were forced to get that tattoo, this and that. Nah, bro. The palm tree has like my meaning to it. You no. Know? Right. It I means uh, victory. Peace and eternal life. Also, I, when I'm around palm trees is where, where I'm at more, most peace. You know what I'm talking about? Right. But And I was with them. So, yeah, I was rocking the whole Island Boy theme. You know, we, we on the island, but everybody knew it was going to fall off, bro, for surely. They're not solid people. Yeah. At all. It would be very surprising to me if they were able to keep a relationship for more than six months. If I showed you the deal that they tried to get, that, that I had signed, you'd laugh at it. Like, they're... they're Idiots, bro. They're idiots. Well, because they claim that you paid them to be their friend. What? That's what they said on, on Instagram Live or whatever. They said that you were you were just paying to be around them. When was them. this? When? Recently? I don't know. I was watching a bunch of random shit last night, and I, I'm pretty sure I heard them I've state heard that. This. I've heard this now. That, so that never took no. place? You never gave them no, money for no, anything? No, no, no. I never gave them bread for nothing. They were actually spending, spending a lot of bread and, you know, taking care of the stuff. Like... But as far as like getting in advance or something, like, you know, when you get signed or like, duh, 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 they're really all about themselves. They're not really thinking about the team. So, yeah, I couldn't, I couldn't do that. You know I, what I'm I mean, it's weird because you just see them pushing their cameo so hard. And it seems like that's probably the, the cameo's not doing no more money. <laughs> yeah, because that's a short lived. Yeah, I'm thing. telling you, like, I was around it. They were like, no, we're not doing numbers. Like, the cameo's not doing Right. Numbers. I believe that they did some numbers for a while. When it was viral, but then at a certain it's point. It's a moment, fam. Yeah. It's a moment. And meanwhile, they're staying in these expensive-ass Airbnbs and shit like that. I mean, that money's going to burn up right away, right? It doesn't even seem like they're focused on the music, though, either, right? Like are Not they, necessarily. They don't seem like they want to make the music better. I was like their director. I'm telling you, bro. Like, back there, that that cameraman that's back there chilling, he shoots for NBA Young Boys People. Like, he shoots for, like big artists bro like right. Dolph R.I.P. Dolph you know what I'm saying he shot for him like big artists bro my, my cameraman really out here be working bro right definitely we're not playing games and I, I we pulled up I direct them, directed some videos for them by the way Fly Soldier you still owe my uh, cameraman $400 so let me know when you're trying to yeah, uh, wire that it's just 400 bro right and so then how do you start rebuilding after this? Do you think it's kind of like a, a, a bad mark on your name as a rapper that you're associated with them? Or you think you can just take, oh, yeah. take oh, the positive yeah. out of this situation and, and make the best of it? Bro, being associated with them made me hot. 
but then again it's like i'm such a positive person that i switched it around mm. and i'm just trying to be like yo people telling me it's not your fault view like those guys are clowns um you know i only respected them or even checked them out for a little bit because you were around them and you know we know what you about and shit so I had a disu uh I, they say they kicked me out. They never kicked me out, bro. I didn't get kicked out of nowhere. I left. I left. You know what I'm saying? Right. They're trying to do this these little internet manipulating the internet shit like uh, the palm tree. We we got to stand no, homie. Nah, bro. But we were yerked up like we were <laughs> geeking and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. The the yerks were the reason for the forehead tattoo was that involved? Most most definitely. <laughs> most definitely. Hey. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, subscribe. We just hit 200K. We're trying to get to 300K. Turn us up. Appreciate y'all. Let's go.